Hello guys, this video is about how to run Android APK files in Windows 11. Please follow the steps with me and let's jump into it. Okay, so the first thing that we need to do is to activate the developer mode. We need to go to settings, just right click on the start menu and click on settings. Okay, in here, click on privacy and security, then select this option for developers. Make sure turn this one on developer mode. Just click yes. And then after that, click on time and language. And on the top says date and time. Select this one. We need to change the time zone to US time. Just any time that you have, any country time you have in here, just change it to US time. And then go back to the language, language and region. Click on this one. And in here, change the language to United States. So if it's not listed in here, just click on add language and look for United States in here and install it. In here, we also need to change country and regional format to United States for both of them. Okay, the next thing that we need to do, open up control panel. Just go to search and type control panel. Open it up. Here, click on programs. And under programs and features, select 10 Windows features on or off. In here, we need to activate virtual machine platform and Windows hypervisor platform. Also, you need to activate this one, Windows subsystem for Linux. And then click OK and wait for this process to complete. And once it's done, then don't restart it for now. Open up the task manager. So we can just go to search and type task manager. There you go. And open it up. On the top, select performance, then click on CPU. And in here is showing virtualization enabled. If yours showing disabled, then you need to access your computer bias to enable the virtualization. So if it's showing enabled, then you can restart your computer. But once the restart has been done, then we need to go to this website and download Windows subsystem for Android with Amazon App Store. The link will be in the description for you to access it. Okay, to download Windows subsystem for Android, just click on here, get install app, and it will take you to Microsoft Store. And then in here, just click on install and wait for install to complete. And then also we need to download this one, WSA Pacman, the .exe file, this one, just click on it and download it. This website link will be in the description as well. So once it's downloaded, then open it up. Click on next, next again, and then install. Then finish. Now we need to search for Windows subsystem for Android and then just open it up. Click on developer and we need to turn the developer mode on. And then after that, on the developer mode, it says manage developer setting. Just click on it. You will get this Windows security. Just click on allow access. And then after that, go back to manage developer settings again. In here, make sure the USB debugging is turned on. So now just close this one and I'm just going to open the Pacman. Just go to search and type in the WSA Pacman and open it up. And if this one is turned off, you can just turn it on. So the Pacman is going to allow us to sideload APK apps onto our Windows 11 device. Okay, I've downloaded these APK files and I'm just going to show you one of them, how to install it. So I'm just going to open up this WhatsApp Messenger. And as you can see, it says install. So just click on install. Select this one to create a desktop shortcut as well. And just click on open up. And there you go. You can see what's up on my desktop. I'm just going to open it up. Okay, so you can see an APK app is running on Windows 11. If there was any problems, then you can let me know in the video comments. Thanks for watching. Hope this video was useful. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more videos.